from Oedipus Rex by Sophocles. Passage 4. Oedipus the king speaks to the citizens of Thebes. They have received news from the oracle of Delphi that the plague on the city is a punishment from the gods for harboring a murderer in the city. Oedipus is unaware that he is himself the murderer. But now, my friends, as one who became a citizen after the murder, I make this proclamation to Thebes. If any man knows by whose hands Laos, son of Labdacus, met his death, I direct that man to tell me everything, no matter what he fears for having so long withheld it. Let it stand as promised that no further trouble will come to him, but he may leave the land in safety. Moreover, if anyone knows the murderer to be foreign, let him not keep silent. He shall have his reward from me. However, if he does conceal it, if any man fearing for his friend or for himself disobeys this edict, hear what I propose to do. I solemnly forbid the people of this country, where power and throne are mind, ever to receive that man or speak to him, no matter who he is, or let him join in sacrifice, lustration, or in prayer. I decree that he be driven from every house, being as he is corruption itself to us. The Delphic voice of Apollo has pronounced this revelation, thus I associate myself with the oracle and take the side of the murdered king. As for the criminal, I pray to God, whether it be a lurking thief or one of a number, I pray that that man's life be consumed in evil and wretchedness. And as for me, this curse applies no less if it should turn out that the culprit is my guest here, sharing my hearth. 